All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's Tuesday, January the 23rd, and Miss Smith should be here with y'all. I um, had this video made earlier with my fifth period, and then accidentally it disappeared. Not for sure where it went. So let's finish going over Garrett Holvey. Of course, that's what the person, the name of the person of the article, article focuses on. And then the problem was his Down syndrome and his MMA fighting. All right, and it says, what nouns or adjectives are stressed in this article? We're looking for things that describe Garrett Holvey, and it has to be located in the article. You can't just say, oh, he has perseverance. No, it actually has to be located in the article. So one of those things somebody said earlier is he's strong. Um, he has Down syndrome. He's also described as being undaunting and dedicated. So there is number three. Okay. And don't freak out. I know it's going to take you all a little bit to write that. You know, I'll leave it right here until I think you have it. And if not, Miss Smith can push pause on the video player. Okay. I'm going to go on down to number four. What is the topic of this passage? Um, the three choices are A, disability, B, Garrett Holvey, or C, is that his martial arts, I think? I think that's what it is. Um, well, up here at the top, we said that the person that this article refers to is Garrett Holvey. So it is going to be about Garrett Holvey. It's a combination of all three, but the main thing is it's about him. It's about his disability and overcoming it so he can fight in MMA fighting. But the main focus is him. All right, number five, which statement would be the most appropriate title for this passage? And I'm going to get a blank one over here so we can go over the answer choices. And we have here, A, the benefits of the Special Olympics, B, overcoming Down syndrome, or C, a young man with a dream. Well, I didn't see the benefits of the Special Olympics because they kept him from doing his MMA. Um, overcoming Down syndrome, uh, you don't overcome it. That's something he's going to be with, live with for the rest of his life. So the best answer choice is C, a young man with a dream. And yes, you can see the answers over here. I know that. I can't help that. Like I said, I actually had this video done earlier, and it, I lost it. So, let's go ahead and go to number six over here, and it says, what sentence from the passage could be considered a topic sentence? Remember, a topic sentence is going to be like your main idea, the thing that it concentrates on. So this says, A, Holvey tried to compete in the league for typically abled fit fighters in his home state of Florida, but the state boxing commission intervened and canceled his match, citing his disability as the reason. Okay, that really sounds negative. Um, let's check with B here. B, Holvey is, a dedic is dedicated to finding an opportunity to participate in the sport he loves. Well, that sounds like what he's doing. Okay, let's check C. And through his dedication to his training, Garrett has even overcome one of the most common characteristics of those with Down syndrome, low muscle tone. That is just a small smidgen of it. So the best answer here is B. It's because he's dedicated to finding the opportunity to participate in the sport he loves. That goes back to talking about him having his disability to over, uh, overcome those things that hold him back so he can participate in his MMA fighting. All right, and of course, number seven, you saw I had it marked. Identify a detail that supports that Holvey is prepared to be a professional fighter. And we have down A, he has done well in amateur bouts. B, he has better muscle tone than many typical abled young men his age. C, he has started a foundation, Garrett's fight. And, of course, the answer is A. All right. Give me just one second, and I'll be right back. All right. 
Now let's look down at number eight. Number eight says, identify a detail that would not support the main idea. Make sure that you put a box around the word not. Okay? And what we did in my fifth period is when we talked about it, we put little check marks out here if it supports it. So this one says, the Special Olympics sponsor supporting event, sporting events for those with disabilities. Yes, but they don't support it for Garrett. Holvey, so that one doesn't really work very well. Let's check B. Holvey has trained tirelessly to prepare to compete. Yes, that supports our, our topic, our Garrett Holvey participating in MMA sports. All right, C. Holvey started a petition on charge.org to change the competition laws in Florida. And yes, that one supports. All right, we already did this when we read the first paragraph, but it's just asking you to do it again, and then this time you're going to box it. So it says, number nine, put a box around the topic sentence in this paragraph. Well, our topic sentence was that first sentence, so make sure you box that. And then it says, underline three supporting details in the passage. Well, guess what? Every sentence after that is a supporting detail. MMA is a challenging combat sport. Learning the elements of MMA is hard hard work and then Holvey has accepted both the challenge and the commitment and then here he's confident that he's ready to compete in the amateur bouts in his home state of Florida so that should answer all the questions for Garrett Holvey uh, Miss Smith is going to pass out the next one about uh, chef Jamie Oliver you're going to read the selection together Help each other find the main ideas, and then you need to answer the questions on your own. When you're done, turn those into the box. All right, have a great week.